Want to get those limited edition Nikes or win the next Supreme Drop? No matter which site that you're copying, you'll need not only a good bot, but also some quality proxies. So let's talk sneaker proxies and find out which ones are the best. But first of all, why do you need proxies for copying sneakers? If you try to buy sneakers without proxies, the site that you're buying from get to see your computer's IP address. It's a way for websites to identify you. So if your bot tries to get you those sneakers by sending many requests, the shoe store will see that they're all coming from the same computer, which means you're using a bot. So you'll be banned for a few minutes. Unfortunately, in those few minutes, the sneakers will be sold out. Sorry, good luck in the next drop. But if you use proxies, they will hide your IP from the sneaker store and this way protect you from bans. Here at Proxyway, we test and review proxies to help you choose the best ones. So if you want to learn more about proxies, subscribe to our channel. Okay, so what type of sneaker proxies should you choose? There are two types of shoe sites and each requires a different approach. The first type includes Supreme and some Shopify sites. Shoe releases there are based on the first come, first served basis. So the proxies have to be very fast to complete the checkout first. Some time ago, that would mean using data center proxies because they have very low response times. However, sneaker stores have become much stricter lately. So there's a good chance these IPs will get you blocked. The second type includes sites like Yeezy Supply, Adidas, Foot Sites, and Nike, which use queue-based systems. This means that you enter into a queue and the sneaker website will choose which people in the queue get the shoes. For sites like these, the first concern isn't speed, though speed is still important. It's proxies that can hide the fact that you're using a bot really well. So although residential proxies are slower than data center proxies, they are a safer choice. These IP addresses look like real people, making it very hard for shoe sites to identify your bot. For more information on the differences between data center and residential proxies, you can watch this video. You'll find a link in the cards and the description box down below. Both data center and residential proxies have disadvantages, so it's important to know there's a third option. It's called ISP proxies. In theory, these IPs are fast like data center proxies and are hard to ban like residential IPs. In practice, sneakerheads use both ISP and residential proxies for their drops. Don't be afraid to try things out to see which proxy type works best for yourself. Here at Proxyway, we recently published a proxy market research. We've tested the major residential proxy providers to find out which are the best based on actual data. If you're interested, you'll find the link in the description. But for now, we'll show you the key findings relevant for sneaker copying. So, which provider has the best residential sneaker proxies? To answer this question, we tested the providers based on several features that are the most relevant for sneaker copying. But before we start, a quick disclaimer. You might notice that our tests won't include some very popular sneaker proxy sellers. That's because sneaker proxies are often sold by proxy resellers that rent proxies from the major providers that we will discuss right now. If you just want to hear our recommended sneaker proxies, you can skip to this timestamp. Response time. The speed of your connection can either make or break your success. To measure the performance of proxy IP networks, we use Cloudflare's IP resolver. While using it makes the conditions artificial, the response time translates well into other sites. We can see that Oxylabs and Smart Proxy are clear leaders. Achieving a response time of less than one second is no small feat. Bright data displayed great results as well, as did NetNut. Soax, S-O-A-X, was an outlier, but not a pleasant one. Its residential proxy IPs were by far the slowest, trailing behind the leaders more than three times. Note that these were residential and not ISP proxies, which is why the response time might not look as impressive. Composition of proxy IP pools. When you buy residential proxies from any provider, you will get IPs from Wi-Fi, mobile, university, and other connections. The composition of the proxy pool is very important. A residential IP network should contain ISP, mobile proxies, or mixed IP addresses. Other types like IPs from cloud hosting companies, commercial, educational, and governmental organizations are just not that good. From what we can see, most of the eight providers neatly meet our criteria. The two that do not are NetNut and Storm proxies. But to be fair, NetNut has a special pool for sneakers that we didn't even use. The third provider, Soax, had a different issue an unusually large number of commercial IPs. IP appearance in blacklist databases should also be taken into account. 
It means the proxy has been abused and most likely already blocked. To test this, we decided to run some addresses through an IP database. The scale is small, so we didn't expect much, but the results are pretty telling. So, which provider has the best sneaker proxies of 2021? Considering our performance tests, we can recommend the following residential IP providers. Smart Proxy for its low response time speed and great overall performance. In addition to that, the price quality ratio is very good compared to other providers. Bright Data for many of the same things, save for the price. Oxylabs because of its overall great performance in all areas. Oxylabs proxies cost similar to Bright Data's, so compared to Smart Proxy and other providers, it will require more investment. Packet Stream. Its performance wasn't as good, but still very decent for the price. And NetNut, because of how few IPs were flagged in an IP database. I hope our recommendations will help you to choose the best proxy provider for your needs. You'll find all the links to the providers that we mentioned in the description below this video. To be perfectly transparent, yes, those are affiliate links. But now you have all the data at your disposal to choose the best sneaker proxies on your own. When choosing proxies, don't forget that the location of your proxies might also improve their performance. Choose the proxies closest to the sneaker site's server. For example, if the seller is located in the US, like Shopify or Supreme, you'll need proxies from the states, ideally New York, Virginia or Chicago. This will make your connection faster. Hey, see you in the next video and good luck with the upcoming drops.